What's up, YouTube? I'm Robert, and you're watching the Biker Bar Podcast. You guys do ride motorcycle too, right? Yep. I actually you rode the dirt bike for the first time yesterday in about a year because we rode in Sun Valley last year. I dropped mine in a river. So I dropped hers in a river. It didn't quite work the same <laughs> after And then we... And then the end, the, the later part of the season was more like XC racing. And then I separated my shoulder, got AC separation in October. And so obviously I was off the moto at that point. And then I wanted to be really smart about making sure I had the upper body strength before I came back to riding the moto just so that I didn't hurt myself. Mm -hmm. And once I sort of felt like I could ride the dirt bike again, um, I was sort of ready to train for this Everesting thing and dirt bike. While it's very fun, it's not exactly the right cross training for riding your bike for 18 hours. So yeah, yeah. it wasn't until yesterday that I felt both recovered enough and like it made sense to start riding the dirt bike again. So that was really fun. Did like a three hour ride with a friend out in the mountains. So you guys know just as well as I do, like being a YouTuber, you don't always get to watch everybody else's videos, like all of them, you know? And no, no, when you said no. that just a minute ago, is was the AC separation the clip that's in your intro video? No, no. that was just a scar. Oh, uh, okay. No, I the AC like, separation, <laughs> he basically dove off our friend's porch face first. Why'd you do that? I mean, with his bike. <laughs> so the bike was supposed to come with him, but it didn't really. So our friends in Arkansas are trail builders and they have this awesome house with like a big deck into the woods. So they built like an absolutely massive drop, probably like 15 feet uh -huh. to a subpar landing. <laughs> they acknowledge but the that. landing wasn't really the problem. The, the takeoff the was the problem. Mackie just blew it and basically just like, dove head first into the ground. Yeah, there are a lot of reasons why I screwed it up. The main one being I was tired from having raced Oz Trails Epic 50 miler like four days earlier. Uh -huh. And I didn't take the drop seriously enough. And I didn't like check out the landing and check like I didn't yeah. do all the things you should do. I was just like, this is fine. I got it. And then I totally blew it. There was a little bit of hubris involved. Yeah. Oh, say. yeah, totally. Yeah. 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 So you get so, like a little complacent basically. You're like, oh yeah, I can do these drops all day long. Yep. That's and crazy. I mean, I know it was well within my skill set. Mm -hmm. But that's, you know, that doesn't just because it's within your skill set doesn't mean you don't take it seriously. And I yeah. needed that reminder. Especially when it's that big. Yeah. So it was yeah. uh yeah, it was a very good reminder, very effective reminder. If you like that, make sure you check out the full episode. And hey, do me a favor. Before you take off, hit the like and subscribe.